what I've done is left home about one o'clock. No, midnight. And I'm here at 3.25. So it's taken three hours, 25 minutes to do the train, the tube, the bus. All because to save 14 pounds. Yeah, which I don't have to give it to National Express. Anyway, um, I'm arriving back at Heathrow, which is the convenience of traveling. If you come to far away places, stations, or airports, it's going to cost you a lot of money. By transport, cost you time. So if you look at the efficiencies of your time, and extra cost on your buses and everything else with low-cost carriers that are operating from these far away airports of the cities in Europe does it worth your time and your money that extra cost the lack of sleep that you're going to get and all of this this is an experiment for me after constant travels is it experiment has told me that i'm consumed my energy on the road for the last three and a half hours to get to the airport and to the train station and to the bus station and right in the middle of the night and of course that said much of the uh, journey was a bit of a scary sight, especially at Victoria Station. All the homeless, all the trash. You can see the night owls waking up. Yes, not a nice sight, folks, if you're traveling alone, especially if you're a lady. Watch out try to save your money traveling from Gatwick, Luton or Stansted airports. People are already having beer at the bar is open. It's crazy, right? He bought his pint before even, what time is it? 3.35. Whoa. 